Hey guys, microphone, anything softwares. Let's talk about that. Okay guys, welcome to a little bit of a, um, an editing setup thing. Um, I'm going to be telling you what, well, I'm going to be showing you basically what I use for voice editing, voiceovers, and to edit my voice. So, just recently, um, I stopped using Audacity to edit my videos because I figured out that there were so many problems that were, that were, it was lacking a lot of things that I needed specifically. I mean, to many, I mean, I mean, it looks so simple, but to me it just looked like something that I just needed a little, little more knowledge in, but it's not that. It's the fact that it has so... It's just not exactly simple. It's not exactly simple. And when it comes out, the quality isn't that great. So, I went on to Steam about two, about a couple of months back, and I got Magic's Audio Cleaning Lab 2016 for about 25 bucks, um, which is pretty good for um, uh, audio editing software. It's very, very good. It's a high quality editing pro um, setup um, and editing software. And that's what I've been, that's what I'm using. Uh, I'm going to be showing you the difference between me editing in Audacity and the difference between me editing in Magic's Audio Cleaning Lab. Um, and I will, I will be showing you that in a couple of minutes. Um, the reason I want to talk about the reasons why I like a Magic's Audio Cleaning Lab better is because of the fact that it is easy to use. It has it's easy. It's very easy. It has more tools. It's 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 just simple, and it's and it has a lot more um, broad um, has a lot more options to it. Um, for example. Um, I was doing a clip earlier today, and I was able to actually re take out every single piece of distortion in the voice, and I was able to take out all the, the fan humming. You can, if I shut up for a minute, you should be able to hear my fan. I am not using, I'm not editing any of this audio right now down. I am still using the Blue Yeti. Um, only I'm using it through the Logitech webcam software, so it is picking up um, through the micro for the through the webcams um, microphone as well as the Yeti. So it's kind of distorted. It kind of sounds a little um, fuzzy and distorted on the edges, but it's easy to use. I mean, um, it's not ex it's. And it gets me there. I mean, there's so many. Um, Magic Audio Cleaning Lab is extremely, extremely useful. When Audacity just doesn't cut it for me. And I'm going to show you the clips right now. Hello, everybody. My name is Olton Famous, and I'm using the Blue Yeti microphone, uh, recording it into Magic's Audio Cleaning Lab, which is about 50 bucks on, on uh, Steam. And you can get it on sale for about 25 bucks, which is really quite good. It's So far, it's proven better than Audacity, but you let me know. This is, what I, this is what I sound like with my voice edited through Magic's Audio Cleaning Lab, and I will show you what it sounds like with Audacity without any um, noise, noise removal or... Um, and uh, voice remove and uh, voice editing. Hey guys, it's Old Mimus here, and I am using Audacity to record my Blue Yeti microphone right now. Um, you can. T um, I am using uh, noise removal, and I will. And uh, this is what it sounds like when I record with Audacity. Okay. Um. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please leave a like, share, and subscribe. And before I go, I want you guys to tell me which program you think is better, and give me, and if you, f just tell me, if you found this video helpful, leave a thumbs up, if you didn't, give me a thumbs down, I don't really care, just tell me.
tell me in the comment section below and I will answer you and if you have any questions I will answer those questions as um, the questions as quickly as possible <laughs> okay guys peace Waboom.